Good girl. We turn. Good girl. Over here. Girl. Touch. Touch. Good girl. Come here. We do the enrichment paintings with the animals to support our keeper enrichment fund, which allows us to purchase enrichment items for all the animals in the zoo. And what enrichment is, is anything that stimulates the animals mentally and physically. It's the same thing that you give children toys for. It gets them to cre use their creative thought processes, it le learning ability, um, keeps them entertained. It's the same concept uh, as providing enrichment to the animals, aka toys to the animals. When animals aren't given things to keep them stimulated, they get very bored and they may even start doing stereotypical behaviors, which are, for example, birds that pluck their feathers. It's a nervous habit, um, animals that pace back and forth. Uh, and there's a difference between pacing and animals that patrol their exhibit. They might actually start scratching themselves or biting at themselves and harming themselves. So enrichment is super important to keep them active and entertained. As a primate, they need that social bonding. All primates do. Uh, and because she is by herself, um, it gives her, I am her companion and it gives her someone to look forward to seeing. Also, it builds a trust between her and I so that I can go in there and hand feed her a small worm and she's not going to try to bite my finger. Um, it also allows me to do other training with her. Uh, she is currently being trained to scale, which I ask her to step on a scale and she does it on command. Uh, she is being crate trained as well, so I can ask her to step into like a pet carrier and she does it willingly, so I don't have to chase her around, make it a stressful environment. So that bonding is building trust between uh, her as the animal and me as her keeper. So we have Bomber because of that. <laughs> and Lady is his girlfriend. Gotta turn around. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> Good job, guys. We get a lot of positive feedback on these paintings um, because one, they're just amazed that these animals are able to produce these works of art. They like the idea that uh, we're going in with them and interacting with them. And I say that loosely, I don't inter go in with the mountain lion or anything. They are intrigued by the abstract artwork and just the fact that it's coming from the animals here at Mickey Grove Zoo is exciting. and. Even if they don't buy them then, we've had a lot of people come back and purchase them at a later date. Uh, they think it's a great gift idea and Christmas is right around the corner, so we're hoping to promote that a little bit. Makes a very, they're one of a kind, we're not duplicating them, we're not making prints, so the one you get is the only one of its kind. The fact that we are selling these paintings to help build our programs here at Mickey Grove Zoo is a side effect of doing the enrichment for the animals. It, it is something that gets them interactive, as you saw with the Curacao, they were there ready to go before I was even done ready, so they do seem to enjoy it and our goal here is to provide the best environment we can for these animals and though this isn't actually natural it gets them engaged and is something that we can do to help entertain them and keep them happy and healthy animals.